Hello and welcome to the world of Cisco's Voice and Unified Communications. I am Lavanya from the Cisco Support Community team. In this video, we look at how to assign only the phone web page access to the end users. The components used in this video are Cisco Unified Communications Manager 7.0 and Cisco IP Phone 7970. While you do your administration and assigning the roles and privilege of different user groups in your network, you can restrict the end users to access only the phone web pages. Let's see the step by step procedures. Log in to Cisco Unified Communications Manager administration page user management. First step is to create end user. Second step is to create new role. Third step is to create user groups. And finally, assign the user group and role to the end user. Now, perform the following steps in order to assign only the phone web page access to the end users. Log in to Cisco Unified Communications Manager with your username and password. First step is to create end user. Go to user management, end user. Click the add new option to create a new end user. Create the user ID for the end user with the passwords and fill the other details like last name, telephone number, mail ID, department name, etc. And save the configuration. The new user ID John is created successfully. Now, Second step is to create a new role. Go to user management roles. Click the add new option to create a new role. Select the application Cisco call manager administration and click next. Now define a name for the new role. Say web page underscore phone and fill the description. Here is the list of resource access information. Now check for directory number web page and phone web page for this new role. Here is the directory number web page. Check the read and update option. Also, check the read and update option for the phone web pages and save the configuration. Now, the new role is added successfully. Third step is to create user groups. Go to user management, user group. Click the add new option to create a new user group and define the name for the user group, say user group one. And save the configuration. Now 
Go back to the Find option. And check for the new user group you have created. User group 1. And click the Role option. Here is the role assignment for the new user group 1. Click Assign Role to Group and find the user group you have created. Click Find. Check web page underscore phone, which is the access for the phone web pages. Also, you need to assign standard CCM admin user in order to access the CCM admin page. Now, check the standard CCM admin user and add selected. Now, the two roles are assigned to the user group 1 and save the configuration. Now we are in step 4. Go to user management end user to assign the roles and user group to the end user. Click find and open the user ID John. Here is the permission for the end user. Click Add to User Group and assign the new user group you have created. Say User Group 1 and Add Selected. Now save the configuration. As you can see here, the roles standard CCM admin user and web page underscore phone are now assigned to the end user John. Now log out and log in with your new user ID John to check the privilege. Go to device phone to check the privilege. As you can see here, user is able to access the phone web page and add a new phone. If the user try to access other pages like voicemail profile, there is an error message stating user is not authorized to access this page. You can check the privilege by accessing other administration pages also. Hope you find this video helpful. Thank you. Let us know what are the topics you would like to see in the upcoming videos and leave your comments. Thanks again.